In the town of Nalim, Arabs waged a violent protest last Friday, as they do every Friday. But this week, Jewish nationalists came to support the soldiers guarding the location. In the Arab-occupied town of Nalim, local residents and foreign anarchist Marxists have held a series of violent protests against the nearby security barrier. I joined um, an excursion of an organization called Im Tirzu um, that is trying to bring Zionism back to the map. Last Friday, members of the Im Tirzu organization held an event of their own, marching to the site carrying Israeli flags in order to strengthen the soldiers stationed at Na'alim. <laughs> Uh, we're from Irtirtsu. We're here today to protest against the violence of the anarchists. After their arrival, Arabs and anarchists began stoning the members of Imtirtsu, as well as the soldiers and police stationed there. We saw here people who throw stones on civilians, on demonstrators. They are trying to say that they are civilians, they are innocent. But we are seeing here that they are attacking citizens. They are attacking women, children, people here. And we're here to show their real faces. They are gangsters, they are criminals and they should be sentenced and sit behind closed bars. Im Tirzu used the opportunity to argue that the Arab claim that weak civilians are going up against heavily armed soldiers is a myth, seeing as the Arabs were attacking members of the student group as well as soldiers. Uh, it's very difficult to even fathom the idea of peace when we see is essentially lethal weapons. I mean, the, the, there was no provocation here. I mean, waving flags of Israel on what's considered by all accounts Israeli territory is, um, I think, is, is a legitimate sovereign right of a state. All the people that came uh, from uh, international activists and the, the anarchists, uh, they're, they're constantly acting against democracy. They talk in, in, in terms, in terminology of democracy, but in fact they come here to tear it down. They don't care about peace, they're not peace activists, no matter how much they say it. They don't care about the Palestinians, they care about destruction and mayhem and anarchy 